Well, just moments after that one gunshot was heard here on Ray Street, an older model pickup truck was seen speeding from the scene. The driver vaguely described as a white male in his 20s or 30s. Tonight, candles and flowers mark the spot where the victim was shot dead. A grainy security photo shows what Denise Robert was wearing before someone shot her dead. It is so random that I can't recall a case like it. At a packed community meeting, Manchester, New Hampshire police tonight offering North End residents reassurances but no real answers. That's what's frustrating. They don't know anything, so we don't know anything. Police, including this officer who lives in the North End, asking neighbors to resist their fears. One incident happens, you can't just give up. You can't just quit. The 62-year-old advertising sales rep for the Manchester Union leader was gunned down while taking her regular Sunday evening walk in this upscale neighborhood considered very safe. I don't want to imagine it. No, I don't want it to be random either. That's the, that's the scariest part. Looking for clues, police are retracing Roberts' final hours. She left the gym near Manchester Airport around 6 p.m., stopping briefly at Vitamin Shop before driving to Walmart. This security photo was taken there. Robert then went to Hannaford before parking her car at the Congregational Church lot. About a half a mile away, she was killed by a single gunshot. Police not ruling anything in or out. It very well may not be random, it, it, but it could be, right? So what I'm saying is I'm leaving all possibilities open. Tonight, police are asking anyone who may have seen Denise Robert before she was killed right here to try to remember any detail, no matter how insignificant it may seem, and to give them a call. Live in Manchester, New Hampshire, Jorge Quiroga, WCBB, News Center 5.